Okay, everybody, this is a video, a how-to video, okay? Now, I'm Kevin. My friends call me the tortoise guy. Now, I'm not the tortoise expert. I have been raising, rehoming, rehabilitating tortoises for 22 years, so I do know a few things, okay? And I want to thank everybody for watching, whether it's TikTok or Instagram or Snapchat, Facebook, um, you name it. And this is the world famous who? Shy girl, everybody. So this is a how-to video based on my experience over the years, okay? How to convince your tortoise to lay eggs. Now, female tortoises, um, when they're pregnant, and we didn't even know Shy girl was pregnant till last summer, everybody. She's uh, go eight years old now, born right here in tortoise land. So that's a whole different story, or it's a whole part of the story, really, okay? We brought in a male, great big male sulcata of which Shy Girl is, of course. And uh, last summer, I rescued him from the pound and he's very aggressive. We kept him behind a chain link fence, but he did break out from that fence a few times. And guess what? He uh, turned out he impregnated not just Shy Girl, but, but Lumpy. So what's going on here is Shy Girl has laid an unprecedented 170 plus eggs over the course of, uh, look at, yeah, thank you. Thank you, Shy Girl. All right, thank you, honey. Okay. All right, she's laid a whole lot of eggs, everybody. Now, a, male, a female tortoise, you look it up, uh, she can mate once uh, and then store the sperm for several years. That's insane, right? So, so Shelly has been gone since like August last year, but she keeps laying eggs, okay? And a lot of eggs, and uh, we have incubated a lot of them, or some of them, and we have, oh, thank you for that. Oh, look, who's here? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, up, up, come on, come on, you gotta help us with this video. Come on, help us, everybody. So, not to say to help with the video, okay? So, this is a how-to video. Okay, so, look, we got the babies, which you guys have all seen plenty, 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 right in here. It's very hot out, everybody, okay? And, uh, so, what's going on is, I noticed this week, uh, her acting crazy. So, if you have a female tortoise and they start acting weird... Come here. Oh, there she goes. Okay, they start acting weird. They're getting up all hours, like uncharacteristically, you know, banging on the walls of everything. Then that's a really good indicator, 99.9% .9 that your, your female tortoise is pregnant. Okay? Uh-huh. Thank you, Jake, girl, for marking me up. That's a good sign. That's a really great sign that she's pregnant, everybody. Okay? So when that happens here at Toy Slam... We are a nonprofit 501c3. So we uh, we built some areas here because we live right in the heart of LA. We do not have acres of land, any of that stuff, but we are very clever in how we handle our space. Okay, so this area she likes. So we built this actually for our box turtles, but Shy Girl has commandeered it, okay? Oh, and speaking of females, here is our beautiful, uh, so friendly, who is this? This is Digger, everybody. Now, Digger's a female. She's five years old, born right here. She's also a daughter of Max, just like Shy Girl is, okay? But Shy Girl's eight years old. Hi, honey. Okay, they got the fresh lagoon over there, all that stuff. Okay, but I digress, which is easy to do. All right, so how do you entice your female to lay eggs? Here's the deal, okay? Females won't lay eggs if they're not comfortable with the spot, if they don't like the soil. If the soil's too dry, which is the case over here, see this? It's been baking in LA. So what I just did, everybody, I got three huge $10 each Kellogg's organic flower vegetables um, uh, uh, soil. The great thing with this soil is it's super moist. The tortoises love it, okay? So guess what? When I get this soil, I'm gonna put another, a second bag in for her. I'm just gonna dump it right there. And I can guarantee you later, I'll come back and this girl is going to be laying eggs, okay? So that's one of the things. You got a female, you got to understand they are not going to lay eggs if they don't like the area, if they don't like the soil, if it's too hard, if it's to this, to that. So you got to accommodate them. We want to accommodate her, okay? And we're not an active breeder. Not an active breeder. We don't do that. We don't ship tortoises. We don't sell them. We're a rescue. So we rehome uh, all that stuff. So right now we're just going to, I'm going to shut my mouth. I'm going to shut off the video. Huh? I'm gonna put another big bag of this stuff. I use a shovel. You can often use a shovel and help pre-dig the hole. I do that and then I'll stick their butt in it. I'll stick Shy Girl's butt in it. Oftentimes they like what I did. They like the hole and then they're gonna lay eggs. So you wanna help them help themselves. Why do we wanna help her? We wanna relieve her of 
of, of laying those eggs. It's painful for her. It's painful. That's why they're bouncing off the walls, going crazy. They'll hold the eggs indefinitely. If they can't lay them, that's not good. Okay. All right. So we're going to, we're going to go shy girl. I'm going to give you some more great soil to dig with. Okay. And you're going to do your thing. You're such a good girl. That's right. Hey, okay, everybody. Thanks for watching the tortoise guy. What's that show? Oh, right there. The tortoise guy.